Hey everyone welcome back to my new PowerPoint tutorial, this is PowerPoint Master. If you're rather first time in this channel, please consider the subscribing. Ok, today we are going to creating this. So let's start. Click the new slide and selected blank page. Now right click, then click format background, chose color for background, you are free to chose own your color in here. Ok I get 4 colors in here. Go to the shape, get rounded rectangle and draw your shape in here. Now right click, go to the outlines, click no outline. Good, we are remove outlines in our shape. Now you can see this small yellow dot in the shape. Now click that dot then hold and drag it that yellow dot over the left side like this. So our shape is good. Now change our shape height into 5.58, and width 3.39. Cool, our shape is ready to design. Now right click, select fill to choose a color our shape. Ok, in here I using eyedropper tool to choose our color like this. Now get another shape and I curve the corners using this, ok. In this time you're free to fix your own size. But you can use my size in here, there is no problem. So, I get three different size of shape in here. In this time I cut my shape like this, you need good eye what I'm doing in here. Click original shape, and I send it to front, now you select both shapes, and then go to the merge shape. Click subtract. Good. Now you see what is the different. Ok now you have to get rectangle shape to cover top of the part like this. I change color into yellow. You get this three different shape, and place it over here to make our design beautiful. I change color into yellow all this shapes. Using eyedropper tool. Click this shape and then right click go to the format shape. Select gradient fill option. Click this button to clear all colors. Now click this item then, go to the color panel. Chose only one color in this time. Then select another color like this, you can see it's very simple. 
Now click this shape item, then hold and drag it over right side. OK, using gradient fill option you can add this color to all this shape like this. I get rounded rectangle and I resize the shape to small. And place it over here like this. Change the color and get copy of the same shape. Second shape I place here, cool. Now I again get another shape. Change color and place it here. Get small text box to add some text for our business card design. You can add more text box in here, but I add only two text box in here. One more thing I forget to add our card, so now I get oval shape, hold shift key and draw nice oval in here. Now select all thing, hold control key with G letter to group all these shape, so I add some shadow for our card to make beautiful. It's not important but you can add this shadow effect. Congratulation our first design is complete. It's time to make another design, I hope you're ready to design. Ok, get same shape we used in last time. In this time I'm not design again same shapes, so I get copy of old shape in here, it's save your time. Some places I speed up my design to save the time in this video.
see it's very easy to design, but you can download this original file free, I gave the link in the description, you can customize this design it's free to use. Ok, don't worry about this icon you're free to download in Google. And change into white color these icon, it's not too hard, very easy to design. And I add some text in here, to make different, cool our design part complete, thank for stay with me, I hope you enjoy this video, if you want more videos like this, tell me in the comment section, thank for watched video, see you next time, bye bye.